Hello. Uh, Cannibal Course just came out with a new single. And I thought to myself after watching about five seconds of the video that why wouldn't I, why not just, why not make like a reaction video to it? You know, I'll watch it for the first time and then uh, try and speak my, uh, my feelings about it as I'm watching it for the first time, you know, because that's a, you don't get that opportunity that many, that often, you know, so uh, I'll do that right now. And, uh. We'll, we'll see. I, uh, well, maybe before I start the video, let me talk about what I felt about Cannibal Corpse the past few years, because I feel that's kind of relevant. Like, I, um, I've enjoyed Cannibal Corpse quite a lot since, uh, since I was, like, 16 or something. So it's for, like, actually for about, like, 10 years. It's about 10 years. Around 10 years. 10 or 9 years, give or take, and uh, I, I love Cannibal Corpse, and I, I remember around when Red Before Black came out, I kind of got uh, a few, I, I kind of felt they were sort of, I wouldn't say falling off, but uh, they weren't hitting as hard for me as they've done in the past few, well, in the past few, not in the past few, but in, in the past, I suppose, you know, I've enjoyed Cannibal Corpse for a lot of years, and then uh, they, I wasn't too big a fan of the uh, Red Before Black and the one after that, which I don't even remember the name of, which kind of says something. Not that they were bad. They weren't bad. I, I listened to them like four four times or something. I, I liked them. I enjoyed them. They were they were okay, but like uh, they none of them none of the stuff that came out within the past few years to me to me hit anywhere near as the stuff for a skeletal domain and back. Anything from skeletal domain and back is is their best stuff, which is you know a lot. But, uh, yeah, look, I'm not very good at uh, explaining uh, more than my feelings about stuff. It's just feelings more than me having a lot of thoughts around it. The thoughts are more so just like I think maybe it's got something to do with the drumming, but I'm not even sure if that's exactly what it is. I can't really remember many cool riffs from the uh, Red Before Black album or... The one after that, violence. Something about something about violence, something like that. That's what the newest, one, the second newest one's called. Like, cause there's a new album coming out, obviously, with this new single that just came out. But uh, what I'm saying is, uh, I think Ske uh, Skeletal Domain was their last album where I really got into it. That doesn't mean the stuff after that is bad for the people watching a reaction video, you know, that doesn't mean it's bad, it just means that I didn't feel the same way about it, and that, that could just be me, I don't know. I've, I've talked to another friend about it, and he kind of felt the same, but, and I, I just I just feel like I read so many comments on these new tracks that Cannibal Compass comes out with in the past few years, you know, those two last albums, all the comments were just positive, I saw no one say nothing about, uh, how they didn't feel as strongly about these albums as the ones before. I'm not saying that, that it all has to be the best shit that's ever come out. Because I feel like Cannibal Horse already has had that kind of thing going on before. Like uh, with, uh, well I wasn't into Cannibal Horse back then. But I have listened to all the albums up to now. Like a lot, everything up to Skeletal Domain. I've listened to all those albums probably over 20 plus 200 times on some of them. Like, I've listened to Cannibal Corpse a lot, and I think, uh, like, around the era where uh, uh, Kill, the album Kill, and uh, what's the other album that came around that time? Um, no, Gore Obsessed is really good. I like Gore Obsessed a lot, but there, there was, I think, Kill, and then some other album that I... There's like two albums that were like kind of forgettable, but they were still they still had some good some fucking bangers in there, dude. But uh, 
like they've had, which is kind of how I feel about these two new, newest albums for Cannibal Corpse. It's just that they've had some, uh, not that they were bad, but they just had like they were, they didn't hit as hard, and they had like a few good ones in there. But then the albums themselves weren't nearly as good as the stuff before, you know. And that's just how I feel about that. And then this. Uh, and what I was trying to say is I think they've kind of gone through that before where they had two albums that came out that weren't as good and then they had uh, yeah like Gallery of Suicide they had that album rules but there's like I would say that album could be like half the times like you could get rid of like half the songs and I wouldn't notice cause the, but like that album and Kill are like kind of meh but they have some they have like four really good songs, which is, in my opinion, like enough for an album. I don't think you need more than f four good songs to make an album, but that might just be me. And I, I'm also kind of just talking out my ass because I might not even remember the which albums I'm thinking of. But um, I might be mixing up songs, and I'll like rewatch this at one point and be like, "Why would I say these albums when I'm really meaning when I really mean these albums?" And I'll like cringe about it later. But anyway. This is a new single from Cannibal Corpse, and I still do love Cannibal Corpse. I love them very much, so I want to watch this video for the first time. I watched about five seconds of it, and uh, I want to watch it. Let's let's watch it right now. Let's do it. Here we go. I'm gonna turn this shit up. Some black metal ass looking music video. The drums could be going a little faster. That's just me. They could be a little faster. <laughs> Sorry. I have to apologize. I don't.
Subjugate? I don't know what that means. I always love George Fisher just having all his hair in his face. Um, they were singing in the in the catacombs from Dark Souls, dude. Uh, I uh, honestly, I, I like I, this. I think it was kind of it sounded sounded better than um, than Red Before Black, but that wasn't the last album. But I kind of was trying to like uh, compare it to. That's what I'm comparing it to in my head. If it sounds better than Red Before Black, then I'm happy. But um, and it does. It reminds me a lot of the the Kill era, actually, which is kind of why I thought of Kill to the begin, like in the beginning. And that's why I was thinking of the Kill album because that's what I was kind of what it sounds like in um. Because I listened to the f like the first five or ten seconds of this before I recorded this, and I thought of that already before I even listened to it in this video, but uh. It's like it's got that. I don't know what it is. Like in the Kill album, it sounds very like grimy and gross and and uh, I don't know what I'm saying. I don't know. It just uh, it's got like a distortion sound to it or something. I'm not exactly sure what it is. There's something to the sound that makes it sound like. Uh, it might also just be the red color. It might just be that the music video is very red. That reminds me of the Kill album. I'm not sure. But um, it sounds like one of the slower, it reminds me a bit of, um, what's that song called? Like Death Walking Terror, but like maybe a little more aggressive. But it's just kind of, because it's, you know, it's like I feel, it's just kind of, um, I, always, I just feel, I, I'm, the only reason I'm not, like, putting a strong word on it is because I, I don't like talking shit on Gamble Corpse because I love them. But it's just kind of forgettable in the discography of Cannibal Corpse. It's kind of, like, uh, less, remem less, uh, it feels like this would be, like, one of the lesser songs on a Cannibal Corpse album. But then again, that was the case on, um, I don't th on the Red Before Black album. I don't remember if they had the title track on the like it's one of the singles for that album that came out before the album. But uh, Red Before Black, and then there was like Shovel Off Their Heads or some shit, and those were like the best songs on there. I don't remember. Yeah, the, and it was yeah. I think those are like my favorites off of that album. But um, what I'm what I think uh. The song is, you know, this is not a very positive review, I suppose, a very positive reaction, but it's it does not mean it's a bad song. I still like Cannibal Corpse. It's also really, I feel we kind of need more, well, maybe I'm not a very good at constructive uh, feedback and whatnot. I don't want to, I'm assuming none from, no one from Cannibal Corpse is going to watch this. They don't give a fuck. They're not going to look up shit like this. But, uh... I know there's people who like Cannibal Corpse that look shit like this up, because I do that, because I like Cannibal Corpse, and I watch other people's reactions on shit, and uh, I just feel like I've seen too many where the whole reaction video is just, you know, just the whole video is then just headbanging to the song, and that's the whole reaction, it's just like, yeah, it rules, this is the, they're back, yeah, they're finally back, and that's like the whole video. And I, I agree, I'm excited they're still making music, I am, I love that they're still making music, I love them. But uh, it's not as exciting as it used to be to me, to me. And uh, it might just be that I've listened to so much other stuff that's not Cannibal Corpse that might have like uh, dulled my sense. What is happening? What the fuck? No, I just had like, it was just like a, I forget. But like, uh, 
Yeah, I just um, I want I want to listen to the whole album when it comes out, of course, and then it's easier to you know it's not easy for me to say much about it other than this because I don't know shit about music other than I know what I like and I know what I don't like, so I just go all by feeling, you know. I don't know shit. I don't know anything about anything. I just like sounds, and then I. Yeah, yeah, I, I go by feeling, and then my feelings are very mediocre. And I hope you have a nice day. And uh, and I I love Cannibal Corpse, and I'm excited for the new album. Believe it or not, if this seemed very uh, not enthusiastic, I'm still excited for a new Cannibal Corpse album. Don't get me wrong, I'm very excited. Let's fucking let's fucking go. Uh, have have a have a nice day. Goodbye.